Mother's Day. Anyone who is watching, any of the women that are watching, Happy Mother's Day. I am a stepmom. I am a mom of two dogs. I was a mom of a 17-year-old American Eskimo. Um, I am not going to be working most of the day today. I'm going to go run errands right now. Um, I need to get me some coffee creamer and some salad and some avocados and uh, some uh, uh, prosciutto and some salami um, and then I'm going to go wash the car fuel it up and we're going out to Rancho Cucamonga today uh, to go out to lunch with my mom-in-law father-in-law and brother-in-law and my husband um I apologize for the breakdown last night. Um, I was uh, I was in a pretty rough spot. Um, my emotions seem to have moved to my back today. Um, so back is hurting again. It was doing pretty well most of the day yesterday. Um, I may work tonight, maybe. We'll see. Uh, depends on whether uh, I have enough time to make the gas going out there worth it. Um, so, uh, yeah, right now I'm, I'm actually going to get gas. I'm going to get gas first, and then I'm going to get the car washed, and then uh, go grocery shopping. I've got about two and a half hours, which is not going to take me that long. It'll probably take me maybe an hour. But, um, yeah, that's what we're doing. Um, this, uh, this necklace and the earrings are from, uh, one of the places that I pick up food from, uh, called Java City Bakery. Um, in fact, I'm there, um, I was there almost every morning, um, before, uh, <laughs> before the money went up and then the money money in went up and the money uh, money out went up and the money in went down um, I was there every morning uh, hanging out with friends and um, and I texted them and said that uh, for a while my breaks are going to be in the middle of the day instead of me coming in the morning and I'm going to be working in the morning as soon as I get to work so um, I'm not going to be able to see King Louie or Louie Jr. for a little bit, but um, I might see him on, on the road or something. Um, they all live in that area, so I might run into him somewhere. Um, so yeah, um, let's see. We are on our way to the gas station right now. Uh, gas went up 20 cents yesterday, uh, overnight. Uh, and right now, it is um, 519 for cash and 539 for credit, which we will be paying credit because uh, I don't carry the cash around on me. So um, I put uh, 40 to $50 in my tank every day, so I, I don't carry $300 in cash on me. So that's what we're doing. Um, and. Um, like I said, we're good. I have a, a club membership at a car wash, so we're going to go to the car wash. And, um, we're going to, um, oh yeah, that's useless. <laughs> uh, um, go to the car wash, get the car washed. Um, where is my Amazon card? I don't know my Amazon card. Uh-oh. That's not good. Where is my Amazon card?
Okay. So, uh, 4212. 4212. So, um, uh, here in California, we pay a dollar more, or a dollar or 30 more than everybody else. Um, 539. So, figure if it was 439, it'd probably be about $10 less, which would have put me at about 3212. Um, which is right on the money on what I made yesterday, which was 320 or 3 310. So it was about that range that we pay a dollar more for gas. So I, I try, you know, but uh, I, I can't uh, I can't compete with California taxes. Um, okay, so I'm gonna go get the car washed, and um, it's kind of cold right now, and I don't have any sweater in the car, but that's okay. Um, I have a heater, yay, um, <clears throat> and uh, uh, then I'm going to go grocery shopping, get some stuff for the car, um, and then we're going to be on our way. We've got to uh, leave about 11.30, 11.45, um, and uh, go spend time with the family and stuff, and uh, yeah, so it should be an interesting day. So about five months ago, um, I sent Pedro Dornash Santiago an email, and I gave my phone number, and I also tweeted Michael my phone number. Um, I was trying to figure out different things that I could do besides driving all the time because I knew that I was getting frustrated with your next and um, things were like really really starting to frustrate me and I needed I needed that um, I don't know I don't know if you could call it brotherly guidance um, if you could call it uh, uh, just some sense of direction um, and uh, I, I like I said, I, I don't know who gave me the link, uh, Rody. I don't know if it was Michael or if it was somebody on Twitter, but, you know, I, I, um, I probably should have signed on to, I, I probably should have applied for Rody months ago, um, because I would have been able to do this weekend, I would have been able to do Valentine's Day, and, uh, I probably could have made some pretty good money without the, um, without the pushing and the shoving. Um, so, but, um, never did talk to anybody. Um, and, and, and it's okay, you know, it, um, it's okay. I, uh, I have, um, a person here that works with me that talks to me on a daily basis um, and uh, you know I, I mean he, he wants me back on the da DoorDash platform you know because I was with DoorDash for six years I did over 16,000 deliveries and uh, I was probably one of the uh, best multi-oppers in, in, in the area um, and some people were learning a lot from me. Um, but I don't, I, I don't, I don't see DoorDash uh, putting me back on the platform. Um, I don't see it at all. Um, they haven't even given me a reason. You know, and, and uh, without that, uh, I don't see what I'm appealing if I don't even have a reason, you know? Um, plus, they were stressing me out anyway. So, I need the break. Um, so, anyway, um, yeah, I, I just, you know, kind of wanted to pick an ear, you know, pick a brain, whatever you want to call it, and, um, I tried, you know, um, 
but like I said, um, I'm gonna get through it. I have support. I'm doing okay. Yes, I have my meltdowns, but I'm doing okay. And yes, I know I talk too soft. Hey, uh, lunch is all done. We had brunch over at the uh, Magic Lamp in Rancho Cucamonga. Um, I, uh, then we stopped by my mom's and we got to see my mom and my sister and my younger sister and my niece and I brought flowers for everybody and I brought gift cards for everybody and, um, and now I am heading to work. I like being treated like an adult. You know, and uh, on DoorDash, I'm not treated like I'm an adult. Um, I like being able to make my own choices on whether or not I want to wait at the restaurant, whether or not I'm going to get uh, uh, punished for unassigning things, um, uh, punished for uh, incomplete deliveries because I don't want to wait 30 minutes or whatever. Um, you know, it. it I, uh, I don't know, you know, um, yeah, they pay half pay, but if, uh, the wait's too long or whatever, but, uh, I, I don't know, I, I'm kind of, um, I'm kind of enjoying the quiet, I'm kind of enjoying not, not having to play. Okay, so it looks like I've made about 101, $102 with, um, Uber Eats, uh, since 510. Um, pretty quiet right now, not getting any orders. Um, I got a couple of orders when I dropped off at a hotel after a batch, but they were all going to Santa Ana, and I don't want to go to Santa Ana. Um, so, uh, right now I'm, um, driving through, uh, West Newport, going towards the 55 freeway. If I don't get anything worth taking, I'm going to... Head home and get ready for tomorrow. Three hours, 105.24, all Uber Eats. Um, two Costa Mesa and I think three in um, Newport. And um, I'm back to getting uh, real low orders, so I am gonna start heading home unless I get um, something bigger. It's been a long day. Uh, work, it was uh, 57 miles. Um, I am heading home. Spent uh, 98 miles today for my uh, family uh, get together. Um, I've got about 20 miles to go home, so that's going to be another um, 56, 86. About 86, I'll be, I'll be at about 186 for the day. So coming to work uh, covered my gas and it also covered part of the Mother's Day gifts.